Hey YouTube, Mark with Ultimate RC. Um, I've got the SR71 Blackbird. Uh, picked this up a few weeks ago. Uh, just have not had good weather um, or light conditions to fly it. Uh, we're back to Central Standard Time. And so there's absolutely no light. Uh, it's dark by 5 o'clock before I ever even get done with work, which I have said it once, I'll say it a thousand times, I hate this time of year. Um, hate's a strong word. Really dislike this time of year. Anyways, maiden flight on this. Uh, I will probably do it all in safe because I'm using the black vertical stabs as opposed to the red. Um, debated, just wanted to do one in uh, the way it looks and I not sure orientation wise how this is gonna be um, but let's give it a go part timer year is filming we'll see how hard this is for her to track a little nervous probably shouldn't be let's give it a go all right we're up Hopefully part-timer is getting some video on this because I don't know how well mine will show up, but it's flying. I've got a three and a half minute timer set on this. Um, we'll see how that does. Sorry about the sun, folks. I didn't do part-time or any favors right there. A little bit of rocking out of it. It's a little windier than forecast today. Uh, it's only supposed to be about three miles an hour. It's probably closer to six. Just fly with that nose up. I've seen that in videos. Uh, you're pretty much, uh, I've been in at least 60% uh, throttle. All right, I'm gonna bring it around. She does wobble a little bit. I don't know if that's the wind today or what's what's up with that there. I did check control surfaces like the book said, although I didn't use a straight edge. I really don't know how you measure 0.5 millimeters. Um, performance on this is supposed to be a lot better with wheels off. I'm not sure I'm ready to do that yet. More from the standpoint of landing it in the grass, I would want to break this thing, but we're going to set up an approach here. Wow! That glides in really nicely. I uh, put it in with a lot of power. I was probably at 30-40% throttle and you could just see it kind of sinking there. Um, so, flies differently than any other plane that I have from that standpoint, but uh, 
How cool is that? Never thought I'd be flying a seven uh, SR-71 Blackbird here. I've got one. Um, pretty cool. I might do a little bit more. Uh, maybe try to do one more flight here. Part-timer has plans today, so I have limited time with her video skills today. Um, we'll see if we can get one more flight in here before she has to take off. Uh, Mark with Ultimate RC. Hey YouTube, Mark with Ultimate RC. Second flight of the SR-71 Blackbird. Uh, it's uh, approaching sunset, so I will probably not do anything out of safe given the nature of this plane and it's a second flight. Visibility, yada, yada, yada. Uh, unfortunately, things were not forecasted correctly today. I had hoped to be flying all afternoon, and the winds didn't finally calm down like they were supposed to until late today here. So, but wanted to get another flight in. No part timer. We'll see how this video tapes. Here we go. All right, we're up. Uh, you definitely have to be in the throttle on this thing for takeoff when it takes off. It, it gets off the ground, but it's very slow on takeoff. Now I'm operating in safe. Uh, that's probably about... 55% throttle. I don't know that I would dare go much more or less than that unless you're high and straight and level. No rudder on this. Although I think the wheel has some effectiveness. Or climb a little bit. I do have telemetry. I want to make sure I'm in that screen. Okay. Uh, definitely doesn't fly like anything else that I have, but it flies. Pretty stinking cool. I didn't think I would ever have. Never thought in a million a million years I would have a RC model of a SR-71 Blackbird, but there I am flying it. Uh, don't know how often I will fly this thing. This is probably going to be one of those uh, when it's really nice and calm like it is right now. You bring it out, fly a few. Uh, not an everyday flyer, but it's cool to say you have one. It's cool to say that you can fly it. Uh, and it's a really nice looking plane too so sitting on your shelf at home um, it, lo it looks just as good doing that so you bring it around uh, I don't think I'm gonna risk trying to do a landing on this side we're gonna come around to the other side Uh, first landing, when you get below half throttle, and especially below 40%, she really, she starts sinking. And I just kept it in, probably, come in, boy, you really lose it right there. See how it's sinking? It's actually really easy to land. You just have to land with a lot of power. Um, you know, again, I was probably at 40% there. And then once she touched that touches down, just chop the power. Um, pretty cool. There you have it, folks. The uh, E Flight SR71 Blackbird. Hopefully, you can see the black plane on the black top. Um, like and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. Those EDFs are cool in the back. They almost look like afterburners. Um, but uh, thanks again for watching YouTube.
Mark with Ultimate RC.